Hey twins and soulmates, how are you guys? Happy Friday. So let's find out what's going on in the energy for the twin flames and the soulmates. This can be for any sign, okay? Thanks for joining in guys, by the way, and thank you for subscribing. And if you're new here, thank you so much for, uh, for hanging out for a little bit. And I appreciate all the love and support on my videos and the likes. Um, once again, thank you so much for joining my live reading the other night. It actually touched my heart quite a bit that so many people joined. Um, it wasn't, I mean, it's not like some astronomical amount, but to me it meant a lot. Okay. Okay. What's going on for the twin flames? Oh boy. You know what? That's enough. <laughs> Just like the book came out right away. Okay. Um, so here we have tragedy, some sort of forbidden love, typical of twins and soulmates. There's some sort of snake in your energy. Someone here could be like for their job, be like some sort of negotiator or perhaps someone is coming back to try and negotiate, you know, their love for you. Perhaps you left for a little bit or something. Crushed, someone here is currently feeling very crushed and lost, okay? There is some sort of drama to queen. I'm gonna put this under the snake. Intuition, your intuition is telling you something right now, isn't it? It's telling you what to do, okay? Here with travel as well, some of you could be at a distance from someone or this is just you going on a little vacation, like a little you-cation, you know what I mean? Sorry, my hair, my hair is crazy right now, just just ignore it, <laughs> okay? Oh, oh, did I do this backwards? Oh, guys. Bear with me say it's, you know, Mercury retrograde is hitting my brain hard. I'm going to, I'm going to just tell you that first. Okay. All right. There we go. plant just like fell down a little bit one more one more uh deck here i'm getting the name Brittany francesca george okay Let's breathe out. <laughs> okay. What's going on for the twins, please? Can I get a couple of cards for the twins? Thank you. So on the masculine side here, we have the King of Wands. So someone here, well, this could be Leo energy. Someone could just be in masculine energy. You don't have to actually be a male. Um, okay, what else here? With, uh, for the masculine. I want to get four chord, chords. <laughs> so that's weird. A chord, so an energetic chord. Um, that was really weird, actually. So with twins, there's um, like an energetic chord that pulls you guys, like that, like is just there. Okay, like you can't get rid of it. It's just like always there. You'll always have this person on your brain, like forever. It's just something that happens. So anyway, I mean, look it up if you if you want. Anyway, what else? So we have the Ace of Coins here. So there's abundance coming in for someone. Someone could be like really like kind of up in money right now. King of Cups in reverse. Someone is not really, someone could be a little over emotional actually. What else here for the, a uh, lot of King energy. So that's good to see. And then the two of cups. Okay, so someone is in their feels right now. The masculine is in their feels. Okay, divine feminine, what did you do? <laughs> okay. <laughs> what did you do, divine feminine? Okay, so we're going to get into the masculine first, and then I'm going to get into the, uh, the femme. Okay, so what's... All right, so I'm seeing something about the police here. Page of wands in reverse. Okay. Hmm. All right. 
this could be past energy or current energy, but I feel like the masculine here kind of went off into some other direction with the Page of Wands in reverse, like away from the feminine. I'm not exactly sure where they went, but what's the Page of Wands? This could be because they can't handle their emotions or something, and they're just like, I need to numb, I need to numb, like I can't deal with this. Someone could have a blue hat. Yeah. Ten of Cups. Someone walking away from their Ten of Cups. To a third party situation with the Three of Cups. Okay. There we go. Okay. Okay, masculine. So, yeah, like I said, um, I feel like the masculine here did walk away from the feminine. Um, they walked away from something to go towards a third party situation here with the Three of Cups. This could literally be a threesome. Maybe more. Maybe an orgy. I don't know. What else? Yeah, the devil in reverse. Ace of Pentacles. Um, the devil in reverse is usually something good, but in this instance, I'm picking up more of like they're, they're trying to mask their... their insecurities with new beginnings or something. You know what I mean? Like they're trying to... You know that new feeling you get when you first start talk, talking to someone and then it just like kind of goes away. Um, but like with a twin or a soulmate, like it doesn't really go away or anything. Like you definitely still feel like very happy and sexual with each other. Like it doesn't really fade as, as, as well as it does with like just karmics. So I feel like what's happening here is the masculine went towards something else here to try and get rid of that feeling because and and it's almost like they're testing themselves too they're like mm, maybe if i go towards like one more person i'll like maybe this person will be the one it's like they're trying to um it's like they, they don't quite believe that you are the soulmate uh feminine okay so it's like they're kind of like, I'm just going to go over here and do this. And it's not going to do anything for them, like, at all. It's just, like, it could be temporary temporary lust, which, you know, whatever. Um, but the next day, guess who they're going to be talking to? Um, anyway, so what's with the Ace of Coins here? And flip and switch the roles, guys. If you resonate more with the masculine side and this is what you're going through with your feminine, then, you know, it is what it is. Yeah, Queen of Wands. The Ace of Coins here is the Queen of Wands, the feminine. The King of Wands, Queen of Wands. This is the divine counterpart. This is a couple, okay? They walked away from you. What's the Ace of Coins? Who's the Queen of Wands? Six of Cups, soulmate. Twin of Flame, okay. Wow, this reading is like super on point with like exactly what I'm trying to say here. Okay, so what is this Ace of Coins situation? What is going on here with the twins or soulmates? What's going on with them? Yeah. Knight of Pentacles in reverse. The offer going elsewhere. The offer, there's just some confusion here about the direction. This is someone without direction. Okay, so it's almost, like I said, it's almost like someone just doesn't believe something. It's like they think maybe this is the person that will make me forget about my soulmate. Maybe this is the person that will really hit that void that's inside of me. And it's not going to because, you know, even with the twin flame, like you're really not supposed to feed that void. You're really just supposed to fill that void from yourself from within. But it's um, karmic, karmic sex does that even more than usual. A karmic sex is like just boring as hell like it's just I mean it may be temporarily like okay but like at the end of the day you're kind of like eh. where's where's my soulmate where's where's my twin flame okay who's the king of cups in reverse this you know I have a feeling this is the the masculine after they do what they do yep <laughs> magician in reverse y'all the empress in reverse not using their intuition the King of Pentacles in reverse, losing money, because they just still aren't connecting the dots that like when they keep doing this, they lose money. They lose wealth. They, they lose abundance. The universe is no longer 
gifting them. They could even lose their gift, honestly, if they don't start acting right. Hmm. Four of Cups. Five of Swords in reverse. What is the um, the Two of Cups here? Nine of Swords in reverse. Five of Swords in reverse. All right, the energy for the twins isn't look great. Isn't looking that good right now, guys. I'm gonna be honest. What else here? Energy does shift, okay? So, Feminine, if you are resonating with this, I feel like you... Oh, okay, here we go. Judgment. Oh, there's a lot of... Two of Cups in reverse. Like I said, Judgment is here, guys. So, um, and this is all being watched by the universe. Star in reverse. Five of Cups in reverse. Okay. Wow. I'm not gonna take all those because it basically gives the same message, but something is just very disappointing right now. Like I said, someone could be like literally losing their gifts. Oh boy. All right. Um, what's going on with the feminine? What's going on with the feminine energy? And the twin or soul or soul flame. <laughs> Look again. Yeah. Someone here could be crying. King of Swords. This is Libra or Aquarius energy. Maybe Gemini too. What else? Eight of Coins. I'm getting that someone here has worked very hard on something, okay? Yeah. Queen of Pentacles. Stable energy. Um, so yeah, I mean, you're vibrant here, feminine. You're really in your, you know, you're really high vibing. As much as you may be in pain right now, I feel like you're really trying to hold it together. And you're doing a good job, okay? You could be just needing to work hard right now with work. Um, you could be kind of also sick of working on something here. What's the Six of Pentacles? You feel exhausted, right? Queen of Cups, yep. You are, you, yeah. Someone here has their eye on something. But the Queen of Cups, this is also like, this could be a psychic. I feel like you are kind of looking either within or you're like looking at a situation and trying to figure out where you should be going. Um, by using, you know, your abilities here. What's the Queen of Cups? Ten of Swords reversed, yeah. You could be trying to figure out if like the worst is yet to come or if like this is it. If <sighs> it's like you're trying to figure out whether or not you should stay stuck or if you should just go into something else. The sun in reverse here. The king of swords. So what's the king of swords with the sun? Three of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah. So if someone here is not cooperating, okay, and this is just bringing in a really depressing vibe to everything. It's like they're just ignoring their own intuition. They're not using their. They're not using. They're not using their abilities for good. They're like using them for their own greed. With the King of Pentacles in reverse, okay. What's, what's upsetting about this is like, you know, 
you know as well, like as soon as, you know, karma comes back around, it's just going to be more delays. It's going to be more disappointments. Okay, what's the eight of coins? Temperance, yeah. So, divine timing is at play here. The temperance also speaks of more patience, divine feminine. Okay, it speaks of more patience. It also says to me here that they're working on something. Okay, so the universe could be working on another lesson for the masculine here. Um, perhaps they just don't quite get it yet, okay? Um, and, you know, with the temperance holding the two cups, I really see that, see that as your energetic cord. Um, temperance, the divine, is the universe could be just trying to um, move the cups closer together, making the stream, um, how do you say, like, thicker, better, like a better stream, you know what I mean? I think also when you do that with cups, it kind of makes <clears throat> things flow a lot faster, you know, versus like being here. It's like, it starts to like come in like thicker and heavier. <laughs> oh my God. I sound like I'm a crazy person. Okay. What else is going on here with this queen of pentacles? The page of cups in reverse. Yeah. You have a lot of disappointment. Because of this disappointment, Feminine, I feel like you're just resting now and you're just probably just taking a time out. I was getting that in the Leo reading too, so you could resonate with the Leo reading maybe. Um, what else here? Yeah, okay. So I do see, do see you guys holding on to each other with the Four of Pentacles. I just feel like this is just another delay. Um, I'm going to get some messages. Okay. almost flipped the star card across the table so <laughs> whoops give me some messages for the twins please All right, so the masculine knows they pissed you off, okay? Um, they do. Uh, and they want to tell you here, well, that you feel like home. You're their favorite. You're my soulmate. They're going to contact you soon. Yeah, 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 we've heard it before, right? They have something to say to you, okay? And this isn't goodbye. Yeah, like I feel like there is a no contact situation going on right now and it's on. They really like you. I feel like they're going to come in all of a sudden with like a very sexual energy. Um, so it's almost like they needed to go through this one last test here or something. They're watching your social media, by the way. They want to make amends with you. They know they pissed you off. They, they know. I feel, I almost feel like whatever they just went towards was like, like, like I said, really disappointing or like almost... Like, I don't know. I'm leaving a situation or mindset that is not serving me. This person may also have like some father wounds that they're dealing with, okay? I wanna get some more, hold on. Addictions is coming out a lot. So, you know, someone can just have an addiction to sex or they could just have an addiction to a certain mindset. Okay. What else? Yeah. Someone here feels stabbed in the back. Ouch, fam. Ouch. Oh, heartbroken. Stabbed in the back. 
coffee cup. There's going to be a conversation coming in soon. The snake twice. This could be literally like a karmic that's trying to like keep you guys apart. Self-indulgence. <laughs> Sorry, you guys. I'm just like, anything else for the twins? The butterfly, the dragonfly. Okay. So there is change coming in and like the universe is kind of like try to be lighthearted. Okay. Just try. Okay. What else? Cupid's arrow. Yeah. They're going to be coming back with like a whole, like, they're going to be like, oh shit. <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> Cause they know, cause they can feel when you're angry. They can feel when you're sad. Right. Okay. So they know, they know. So, you know, it is what it is. Right. I mean, Ay, ay, ay. All right, guys. So I am going to take off now and maybe do another reading, but I hope you guys have an excellent day. Bye.